it's a great sunny day it's a great day to go out shopping so i haven't been cutting my hair ever since the pandemic started which was um, around march 2020 so it's been a year my hair is very long now i kind of like it so i'll probably just leave it like that yeah so this is where i'll be shopping today it's uh, at orchard central i'm going to shop at don 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 key so this is the area between orchard central and 313 and i'm walking towards um, the leaf to go down to don 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 key now uh, there are a lot of young people and then of course mass is compulsory here in singapore uh, this is the pastry or cafe that is very prominent every time I am coming to Don Don Donkey. I'll definitely have to pass through here. And then, yeah, we are coming to the leaf and we are going down to basement too. So, they have a lot of leaves here. I think they have around 10 or more. So, you get to hop on to one of it quite fast. So basement one is actually Don Don Donkey area that sell all of the skincare, Japanese skincare, Japanese tidbits, snacks, drinks and etc. And basement two will be the supermarket area. When you walk out from the leaf, on the left side is the supermarkets and on the right side is the all of the ramen stores and, and Japanese food that you can you know sit down and eat, order your food and eat. I'll come and uh, visit it some days and then the supermarket area they have expanded on the left they started to have the cooked food area previously they don't have it so now you can purchase the cooked um, food Japanese food and bring back home to eat so I wanted to um, purchase some but uh, when I came out from my supermarket grocery shopping, they already closed. You can see some people are looking at things to buy here. So now we're going to walk into the supermarket area. So this is the new normal now, the life here. We have to queue and get our QR code scanned before we can go in. So I am walking over to queue. So the queue today is not that bad. Some days the queue is really long. So it's like a U shape. So now we are entering. This is what we see the first thing. Apple, huge large apple. So of course we can touch and feel the fruit. So if you buy anything from the supermarket, remember to wash it thoroughly before you eat. And they have oranges here, 1090 for one whole pack. Saga Mikan, that's the name of the oranges from Japan. And then these are the grapes, 880 per pack, which is actually considered cheap because most foods or fruits in from Japan is very expensive. And then you have the red and pink strawberry at 1980 per pack. Yeah, and these uh, grapes look so good. I bought it, but then it looks good, but it tastes Mm, not so nice just not my kind of grapes I like crunchy grapes it's not definitely it's definitely not crunchy grapes and then this is apple juice 1880 large bottle it's so big apple juice 1880 yeah haven't seen such a large bottle of apple juice before in, in glass bottle or you know these are all the apples and Japanese banana looks good looks so beautiful 390 for a pack quite tempted but then if i buy this we don't really eat a lot of bananas so i decided not to get this but yeah you can see i'm quite tempted and then these are the oranges area yeah from Japan as well and this is 
the strawberry fair. They have the red and pink strawberry. The pink strawberry one whole box of two pack is thirty eight eighty. Someone told me the pink strawberry tastes like strawberry and pineapple combined. I'm not sure what kind of taste is that. And this red strawberry is so big. I'm tempted, but then I decided not to buy. And these are the chips, the sweet potato chips. Purple sweet potato chip is very nice, so I took a pack. And or more oranges here. Look at this watermelon. It's just the size of pomelo, but it's 40, $42.80 for one. If we were to buy oranges um, from produce from or not produce but uh, planted uh, or came from Southeast any Southeast Asia country, it's probably just three sixty per per one uh, uh, watermelon. But this is forty two eighty. It's crazy. And of course, uh, sweet potato, Japanese sweet potato is extra sweet, so I bought a pack as well. They have both the purple version and the yellow version. I bought the yellow version apparently. I wanted to buy the purple one, but yeah, ended up to be the yellow ones. Only the skin is purple, it's fine, it's still nice. And the broccoli. These are the three types of fresh mushroom three packs for just five dollars, which is very cheap. We have the large mushroom, the small size, and then yeah, the other type of I can't remember what's the name of this mushroom. Anyway, carrots, daikon, or the radish. The whole aisles of uh, vegetables. Japanese vegetables is more expensive than the Asia vegetables, so yeah, 1990 and you know that kind of prices. But it's um yeah, maybe carrot carrots. So these are all of the food, the the. What what are these noodles? Yeah, it's um the aisle is actually quite narrow, so we have to squeeze through in between the crowd. These are for um noodles or even steamboat. And uh, many people blocking the way. These are Japanese milk. Some people prefer Japanese milk. I am not a milk person so I cannot comment or make any comparison. Some Japanese uh, drinks or juices and then we come to the pastry area. So they have this um, cheesecake eleven ninety, and then the crepe. Yeah, these are the crepes. Um, Jap Japan, if you go to Japan, they have a lot of these kind of crabs. And these are the ice cream. No, it's crepe, crepe, crepe cakes. If you are lazy to bake, you can buy these frozen ones and just defrost and eat. These are scallops, Japanese scallops, 2680 for a pack. They are quite large. And we are coming to the um, salmon area. Salmon head, salmon, fresh salmon um, meat. And I bought the bone and skin because they are delicious. That's where the, they usually cut from the belly area. That's where they are extra delicious. And these are the the what do you call it? The Chinese uh, low hay package. More crabs. Okay, coming to the the other area where 
they have mentaiko. I used to love mentaiko, and then there was once the mentaiko that I bought was not so fresh. It's a bit stale, and I stopped buying mentaiko ever since. Otherwise, just mentaiko and white rice is very delicious. Fresh prawns, and then we are coming to the um, um, meats area. So Donut Donkey has got a lot of sliced meat for steamboat. It's like um, in the fridge, in the freezer, in uh, um, nice um, container box or in this frozen um, packaging. So they, they have so many variety of meats uh, for um, steamboat. Okay, Japanese soy sauce. Japanese soy sauce is good for um, steamed fish because they are a bit sweet. More like the Asian soy sauce is just um, mainly salty. And we are here at the um, instant soup and noodles area, and then there's meat area. So I'm here at the instant noodle area. They have a variety of instant noodle, all from Japan, obviously. And then the seasonings so I'm here at all of the noodles area and I saw these noodles yeah I like Japanese noodles um, because they don't turn soggy fast the instant noodle I haven't tried all of them there are too many varieties so I don't know which one is good but I like Ichiran Ramen, Ichiran is good, but Ichiran is not the cheapest instant noodle. It's almost the same price as one proper bowl of noodle if you were to eat at the food court of or hawker center. So, so many types of instant noodle to choose from. If you are looking for Japanese uh, instant noodle, you should come to Don Don Donkey. Everything under one roof. Yeah, this is the the pastry. Yes, with the red bean paste in the center. So I think Jap it's famous because of Doraemon. If you watch the Doraemon cartoon, you'll know that Doraemon loved this. Okay, we are going to... I'm um, walking towards the payment area. So that's how you walk in and then you walk out from here where if you walk through here, you have to pay already. I decided to not yet and I walk back in because I haven't finished shopping. So this is coming from the beginning again where the apple area was behind me. That's where you enter from. And more seasonings on the right shelf. Uh, all type of Japanese seasonings. Yeah, that's that's how the, how the whole place look. And yeah, here I am finally coming over to queue and pay. So yeah, places these days or, or outlets these days they are very smart. While you're queuing for uh, to pay, they intentionally display more things on the left and right. So that you know, while queuing, you get bored while you wait at the queue, and you may end up picking more things uh, that they display on the left and left and right. So I was just um, looking at the stuff that they display while queuing, and yeah, definitely saw a lot of things, more instant noodles and and uh, Japanese ramen I should call it right they don't call it instant noodle and then this one looks so good 15.90 and this is the wasabi uh, pistachio nuts looks so good as well but then yeah not this time I still have a lot of snacks at home and the lychee jelly so tempting should be very refreshing and nice next time maybe <laughs> And where are we now? Okay, time for me to pay. My turn.
Yeah, I just returned from Dong 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 Key. These are the things I bought. So I bought actually quite a lot of things. Three bags full from Dong 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 Key. And then I actually four plus this one. And then I went to um, NTUC as well. Before Dong 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 Key. So I have this from NTUC. One, two. And three. Okay, for NTUC, they say some outlet they already starting to charge for paper bag. So it might be a good idea to start bringing the recycle bag when you're out shopping. Okay. Now I am just going to quickly take the thing out and display. So these are everything that I bought today. It's not a lot. Uh, sometimes I bought a lot more. So we're gonna go through the things one by one. So this is a huge chicken. Very fresh chicken. And it's only at 6.33. And uh, our house, we always buy one whole fresh chicken all the time because uh, we eat quite a lot of white meat and seafood seafood mainly fish more fish than any other seafood so we eat quite healthy here so what uh, we cook with is the chicken with is like for example chicken soup, chicken noodles uh, fried uh, ginger chicken with rice or um, the Indian uh, varuvar chicken with rice and uh, yeah, mainly those. Uh, yep. And then this um, salmon, salmon skin, salmon skin and bone, salmon meat and bone. It's just four eighty. It's very cheap, so it's very fresh. This is mainly the salmon belly. Normally, it's that portion, and it's very. Um, Expensive if you eat salmon um, sashimi, so this one is just for eighty. We will normally either steam and eat with uh, chili sauce and rice with cabbage, or we'll um, probably deep fry. So these are the way we eat this. It's very good, by the way. And this is the sambal blachan that or the chili sauce that I always eat this uh, dish with. This brand is very good. We always uh, stock up when it's out of stocks. You can get this at NTUC or Sing Show. This one is just, I think it's about 210 It's uh, quite a good price right now. It used to be quite expensive. Let me check. Uh, where is the prices from these bags? Oh, it's not here. Okay. So anyway, and then there's this, yeah, I think it's just 2 plus, it's quite a good price. You can try this, it's really very good. And this guava, it's um, sometimes when you buy good guava, it's very crunchy and fresh. So when we see guava, we will buy these things. And what are the other things? These are from NTUC and these are the, this is the only last thing from NTUC. I saw uh, the... Sambazon Akai Akai? Yeah uh, Asai, sorry you should, call it, you should pronounce it as Asai So it's organic, daily free Vegan, gluten free Gluten free So um, Yeah, I saw um, some Vlog, vlogger They add this for lunch I think they Add some fruits, nuts Variety of nuts Fruits and Cereal maybe, I'm gonna try this Some days I don't eat dinner So I'll eat something light So this looks like a good meal I will google search and find out um, How to eat this But it should have a lot of 
health benefits. Yeah, so if you want to know how I cook and eat all of these uh, dishes, you can um, go to my other channel, it's Love Laurel. And then now we go to item I bought from Don 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 Tea. So first start with these grapes. You know fruits in Japan is super expensive. This one, 880 is considered the one with better price. So let's, I'm gonna try this, hopefully it's nice. And then um, this is the noodles that been out of stock for a while but it's very good. So today I saw it and I just bought it again just to keep some stocks at home. Then we can, keep, we can cook noodle soup whenever we want. This whole pack quite a lot. It's just 9 90 So I like um, you know noodles that don't turn soggy too fast. So this one is quite good from Japan. And uh, when I don't eat dinner, I will probably... Um, eat this. This is one of the things that I'll probably eat when I don't eat dinner. Corn soup or even cereal with hot Milo. So I can add corn, um, cereal in here as well to make it less um, light and you know make me feel less like um, hungry. So I'm looking forward to eat this because I like corn, corn soup, creamy corn soup should be very nice. And uh, Japanese chili, you know when you go to Japan, sometimes they just grill this and then they eat it with beer, it's a like beer food. So Japanese green chili usually is not spicy, it's sweet. So look forward to eat this, maybe just grill or eat with the um, Korean um, barbecue wrapped with the uh, lettuce. And gachujong, gochujong. How do you call it? I think it's gochujong. And of course, Japanese uh, sweet potato is always extra sweet and extra fragrant. Um, saw this uh, at Donald Donkey. It's just about six ninety. It's more expensive than the Asian or the tropical countries version, but um, it's usually sweeter. So looking forward to try this at home. Uh, in addition, I bought the chips as well. The chips version is about four ninety. Um, you can see here it says yaki mo chips, lightly sweet, baked sweet potato flavor. Should be very good. Looking forward to eat this too. And uh, I saw this Japanese uh, radish is usually extra sweet. So this one is just two third, two, two not thirty two and two dollars and three cent. So gonna cook cook some. Um, miso noodle soup tomorrow maybe we'll cook together with this yeah miso noodle soup and I saw this I like um, bean sprout um, with the large bean so with the extra nutty and crunchy um, bite so that's why when I saw this I just need to buy it's just 190 what we're gonna do is, I think, uh, once we cook the miso soup together with the chicken, of course, and this is dash, you know, uh, the radish, daikon, I think they call it daikon in Japanese. So, and then uh, we're just gonna boil this a little bit and then put in a plate as side dish with a little bit of um, fried onion or fried garlic on top for the additional crunch and then with the Japanese sweet soy sauce yeah will be good as a dish side dish together with the miso ramen soup and of course not forgetting the Japanese cabbage now offer at 331 Japanese cabbage is usually very nice you can eat it as salad just need to shred it like Ma Mason has uh, unlimited serving of the um, shredded um, cabbage with uh, it with the sesame sauce was so good so I saw this and it's not expensive at Donald Donkey gonna have uh, our own home make uh, cabbage salad with sesame seeds sauce so those are the thing I bought.